people are pretending they're on alive because of the grimace shake. They take a sip of the shake released by McDonald's, then cut to a shot where they're either laying down in some obscure place with a shake all over them, or a shot of them going crazy. Some people have even gone to extreme lengths, like filming in the sewer, an abandoned building, or the hood of their car. People are confused on whether or not McDonald's is paying people to do this, but there are some theories surrounding it. It could have been a trend started by McDonald's with the hopes that it would catch on to the general public. This would be genius, and I wouldn't be surprised considering their past with the Travis Scott meal and the meme that came with it. According to McDonald's lore, Grimace was originally known as the evil Grimace and obsessed with stealing milkshakes from little kids. This could be seen as funny to the older audience, but could be detrimental to their sales if kids see the trend and think something bad would actually come from ordering a simple shake from McDonald's. On the opposite side of this, the people who believe a huge evil monster that's modeled after a giant taste bud will steal their drink are probably too young to be on the app to see the trend. No one really knows the true flavor of the Grimace shake, but it's described as having a mixture of vanilla and berry flavors. This is important because in another theory, people say that the reason people act weird after drinking the shake is because of the blueberry shortage of 2022 and 2023. With these supply shortages and this bizarre trend, everyone has been left wondering what's truly inside the Grimace shake.